Hi. So I want to quickly show you something here. Say you're playing your balance druid and you're running around in boomkin form, but you quickly need to heal yourself up a bit. So I just use a bit of spells here, maybe just shht, regrowth, nice. And then I want to go back into attacking. Let me see if I can make it work. Yeah, see this. There we go. I just, I have my keys here set to outside of Moonkin form. I press any of my damage rotational keys. I go into Moonkin form. I don't want to ever be out of Moonkin form. Um, and yet I've just applied Moonfire and Sunfire and I'm still not in Moonkin form. Now, if I wait a bit and press that's not going to be a problem. But if I press inside the global cooldown, as you can see, let's see, it depends on lag. So sometimes it, it doesn't work, but when it does, see that, that's just super duper annoying. Um, and it has to do with uh, spell queue. And if you don't know what spell queue is, a lot of people talking about it will say something like spell queue is the time in uh, the the thing you need to mind to have a uh, rotation that is working smoothly and they really focus on these gaps in between your global cooldowns and that's huge that's very important um spell what what this basically is is the time in which you can in, in advance that you can press a spell before using it uh, before it uses it and this is in relation to global cooldowns so you have your global cooldown there, and if you see I'm pressing it now, before the global cooldown is over, it still goes off, which is important, and it weaves your spells together, right? And and if you have, um, well, in, in our day, uh, we have latency, we have input lags, all these things, uh, with when it comes to computers, when it comes to the internet, obviously, um, having a system that just takes it in a bit of, in a bit in advance what you want to do, uh, and sends it off to the uh, to the server out there, makes it so that it activates quicker because then the spell is already sent to the server and ready to be activated. Activated. <laughs> and that's really great. But um, if it's too long, you're, uh, you're, you will feel laggy. And this is because it is set to f uh, in relation to your latency. So let's go and have a look at it. I have an add-on right here that I recommend so much you can set this and change this in a chat with a console that i'll leave in the description and you just change the number in the console but if you go to interface uh, and you have this add-on it's going to be inside of this combat tab there's these many many things that you can set up here uh, this one is called spell q if i can actually spell that but um but luckily they know that this is a really commonly changed thing so they've just put it right here as a lag tolerance which is also what it is it's tolerance of lag and it relates to your um latency so if you have 400 latency i actually think this is fine and you'll never experience that problem uh, of uh, going into uh, or using a spell before you go into form when you have it set up like this um but you don't have 400 latency not most people have 400 latency if you do have 400 latency and you're playing this game fucking god bless you you are <laughs> you are living a you're struggling um and i hope you get to to better places <laughs> that's i uh, yeah I've, I've been there i've been there trust me um <laughs> but what you want to set this to is um what i've been recommended is your latency plus 100 and 100 is supposed to be like a buffer uh, that just makes sure that it always keeps tight uh, and then your latency which mine is like 39 40 right now there we okay yeah that's fine that's fine this should do the trick and i wonder if you can see a difference now i'm gonna try to show you again so healing myself swift mend up and ready so again healing myself ready go healing myself ready I couldn't even show you, I, I, I can't even make it happen. I'm, t I'm trying very desperately to make it happen. It's just not happening. It is just not happening. I'm so happy about this, by the way, because I've been struggling with this for so, so long when I figured this out. Um, where I was cat weaving as a healer and it just, it just ruined everything. It ruined everything. Uh, <laughs> and your rotation and, and everything and, and your uh, enjoyment of the game. I think this just makes the game more smooth. It's 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 honestly 
almost as big as going from like one to three keybinds of like my main spells to to keybinding everything. It's it's that change. It's huge. Uh, so I really think that you should mind this. And it's not just for druids. Um, you have something like shadow form. If you have a stance macro for shadow form, basically a macro that uh, if you are not in shadow form uses shadow form. If you are in shadow form uses shadow word pain, for instance. It, it would work the same as this, right? Uh, you you go into form by the same button that you press moonfire with. So shadow is the same deal. I can think of uh, some others as well. Warrior with the shield changing. I did a video on that. Uh, if you want to learn about how you change your uh, weapons as a warrior but unfortunately that uh, the, the the macros of that have changed so much since the uh, since the beta they've changed so much about that so be sure to read the description of that one to get the right macros not actually the one I'm, ones I'm talking about hopefully this won't change this has been in the game for a very very long time uh, and I think it was in Dran or something like that that they changed everyone's to just be basic 400 um, but I think 400 is way too much for most people. Set it down. Look at your latency. Um, I think it's it's the world latency that, that should... Maybe it's the home. I don't know. Should test around with it. See if it works. If it doesn't feel snappy, uh, take it down a notch. If it feels... Uh, <laughs> yeah, you should at least have 100. Just at least have like 100 or 80 or something like that. Just for that uh, original purpose that, that people talk about, uh, not having gaps in between your global cooldowns. That's really important, but once you have that, you don't need more. You don't need any more, and you need to be able to smoothly change into your um, stances here. I hope this was useful to you. Thank you so much for uh, for watching, uh, as always. But, uh, but yeah... Uh, I, re I really hope this is make gonna make your game better. It made my game so much, so so much better. Thank you so much, and uh, bye.